Hi everyone, this is Fake Hair Mama. Thanks for joining me today. Today we're going to be going over how to travel with your wigs. Whether it's by car or by plane, what do you do with them? How do you store them and how do you store them when you get to where you're going? <laughs> My method is very cheap. <laughs> I'm always looking for ways to save money. You could invest in one of those little wig carrying cases. It looks like a hat box or a hat bag. But to me, when I'm traveling, space is at a premium, whether we are loading up the car to go somewhere or on an airplane especially, you, you don't have that much space or to store your wigs. So all I use is a Ziploc bag. <laughs> Very simple. So here we have Jones by Aesthetica. If your wig came to you and the uh, cap's side was out like this, then that's how you would store it in the bag. So you just put it in the bag, make sure all the hair is in there, and you get the air out and seal it up. That's it. Doesn't take any space at all. You can put it in your suitcase or your carry-on bag or in a separate bag, however you want to do it. If you have a longer wig, like Jessica here, you can still use a Ziploc bag. Just kind of loop the curls in there. With a longer wig, you'll want to make sure when you get to where you're going, you're going to want to put them on a wig stand so they don't, uh, so they keep their shape. So same thing, get the air out, and there you go. Jessica's ready to go. So what I also like to bring along with me is one of these uh, wig stands. They come apart in uh, three pieces. They're very lightweight, but when you get to where you're going, you can um, hang your wigs and um, keep them nice that way. This is what it looks like when it's apart. You're also want to, gonna want to bring uh, the normal normal wig products that you use. For me, that would be the styling silk and the it stays. The only thing I would recommend, especially with the it stays, uh, some of it tends to leak out around the rim, and so I would put it in a um, a little baggie, another little Ziploc baggie, so whatever you're storing it with will not get uh, sticky. <laughs> <laughs> Not that it wouldn't wash off, but it'll, it'll avoid a mess. It seems to happen more when it's warm outside. So if I'm not using a plane, then I'll just put all my wig products and my wigs in a bag um, along with any other accessories that I want to bring with me, whether it's barrettes or, you know, headbands, that kind of thing. If you're traveling by plane, I would highly suggest that you put them in your carry-on bag. You don't want those to get lost because that'll be your most important accessory, I think, <laughs> to where you're going and you don't want anything to happen to them. Let me know what, uh, what tricks you have used for traveling with your wigs. We are starting to travel a little bit. I wouldn't say like, you know, we're not going to another country or anything, but we are visiting family uh, for a couple short times this summer. And uh, so I'll be using these methods when I travel. But let me know if you've uh, done any other methods when you travel with your wigs and what has worked for you. Thanks for joining me today. I hope these tips were helpful for you. <laughs> it's a short one today, guys. <laughs> Please like and share this video and thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye.